Today I'd like to share my thoughts on what is the best way to learn a handstand. What I mean by learn a handstand is to be able to hold it without any assistance for at least 10 seconds. When I was in the process of teaching myself how to stand on my hands, I tried various approaches, but the method I'm gonna be talking about today gave the best results. So without further ado, let's get down to the specifics. I will talk about particular exercises, but the most important message of this video is how to schedule your workouts. Handstand is a highly technical skill that doesn't require you to build a lot of strength or endurance. It's all about learning how to keep the balance by controlling individual parts of your body. This is very difficult, especially in the beginning, because your mind doesn't know what's going on when you're inverted. This is why I strongly believe that the fastest way to get the handstand is to practice it every day for 15 minutes or even less. If you're highly motivated, you can do it even twice a day, because this practice won't be very strenuous. By training so often, you will get your mind used to the inverted position quickly, and this will allow you to start thinking about controlling the body. Why only 15 minutes? Because after this time, your muscles are starting to get too tired and your learning efficiency drops significantly. If you would go on training, you could strain your muscles too much and that would negatively impact your next practice. And the best part of this plan is that it doesn't collide with your regular full body workout or split or whatever you're doing. You can do it in the morning and the handstands in the evening. If you didn't kill your shoulders, then doing 15 minutes of handstand practice should not be a problem. Before every workout, I'd recommend you to do this quick wrist warm-up, because without it you're risking an injury. First you need to stretch them by doing 20 reps of each of the following exercises. Once you feel you have the full range of mobility, you should warm up the muscles in your forearms that are used to balance the handstand position. This motion of pushing away with your fingers is what keeps you from falling on your back when you're standing on your hands, so it's good to warm up and strengthen those muscles. After doing 20 reps of that, you should be ready for the 15 minutes of handstand exercises. I am assuming here that you can already hold at least 30 second handstand by the wall. It's purely about strength and endurance, so to build it up you can practice it as a part of your regular workout. So what should you do during those 15 minutes every day? Well, just try to hold the handstand as long as you can, there's really no way around it. You try a couple of times, take a break, try again, take a break again, and so on. After 10 or 15 minutes of that you should start getting tired, so it's time to stop. Even if you don't feel like you learned anything afterwards, you just exposed your mind to another dose of how it feels to be inverted. It's gonna get used to it more and more, until one day something clicks in your brain and you will be able to hold handstand out of the sudden. This is how it is with this position and I've heard multiple people confirming it. At the beginning I recommend that you focus on learning how much of a swing you exactly need when kicking up with your leg because this will be your first method of getting into the handstand position. If you overdo it, you will fall on your back or hit the wall. If your swing is too weak, you won't get high enough. Learning the exact amount of swing is a game of repetition, so this everyday practice will speed up the process. Ideally, you want to do it without any assistance, and when you lose your balance, just land on the other side like that. However, if you feel like you need a wall behind you, I would suggest to place your hands at least a meter away from it. This way you're gonna have enough space to practice fighting for balance if you happen to bring too much weight in front of you. Practicing freestanding handstand too close to the wall could make you develop a habit of relying on it fully, instead of trying to control the position with your hands and the rest of your body. And that's it guys! There's no secret solution to learning the handstand. Just 15 minutes a day and you're gonna have your first 10 second hold in no time. See you later guys!